unicorn. It only exists in fantasies, dreams, and Harry Potter books. Yet those who follow Maryland baseball say they know the unicorn is more than just a myth. With that in mind, we sent our own Care of Magical Creatures instructor to College Park to find out more. Here's Mike Hall. The dictionary defines the word unicorn as a creature of the imagination, a person that exists only in legends or myths or fiction. But the University of Maryland defines a unicorn as Mike Shawarn. On the mound, Mike Shawarn. One of the top pitchers in the entire country. Without question, the pitcher known as the unicorn on this team, uh, definitely dominant so far. The legend of the unicorn began just 130 miles north of College Park at a small high school in southern New Jersey. I went to Gloucester Catholic High School. It's probably about 10 miles outside of Philly. Played four great years there, won four state championships. Going into my senior year, I was drafted by the Kansas City Royals. I got the call, and it was almost a surreal moment. It was literally every kid's dream. But, you know, for me, I valued my education. My junior year in high school, I sprained my UCL, so I sat out the year. You know, it showed me how easy the game may get away from you. If I'm fortunate enough to play however long, that will be awesome. But at the end of the day, I'm going to need an education. After turning down his major league offer, Shawarin still had to decide where to play college baseball. His choice came down to Duke and Maryland. He had told us that he was going to make his decision in October. It's the time he's going to make his decision. We call him, we're, you know, we're communicating. He's like, Coach, you know, I, I think I need a little bit more time. I'm probably going to make my decision next month. Next month comes, and he's not ready to make his decision. And then it all it went all the way up until February. They have these weekly meetings, and they'd always ask, you know, what's up, Dale and Schwarin? Like, has he committed or not? And they're like, no, he hasn't committed. Like, is this kid a mythical creature? When we found out that he committed, Coach Vaughn that next day got in a little bit before me, and I just walked in there and right in the middle of my desk, it's a giant unicorn photo with a sign captured right across it. A guy that you feel like can come in and impact your program right away. It was huge. Then the freshman year I had, it kind of brought to life the unicorn. Three strikes. Strikeout number seven for Schwartz. He gets a big out there. 13 strikeouts, a career high. When he came in, the expectations were high. We just kind of threw him into the fire and threw him in the deep end of the pool and see what he did. The unicorn in lockdown mode. Broken the single season strikeouts record. He's broken the single season wins record two years in a row. He's broken the career wins record. Back to back strikeouts from Schwartz. Last year, first team All American. This year, he's a preseason All American. He was first team All Big Ten last year. Shipley swings and misses. Tenth punch out for Mike Schwartz. It's a great honor to be able to do that in two plus years here. And it's always cool to have your name solidified in history. For Shawarin, more important than the personal accolades and records is helping Maryland advance beyond the Super Regionals and reach the College World Series. Going back-to-back -back Super Regionals, that was amazing, and hopefully we can do it for a third year. We got off to a little slow start, but we've been battle-tested enough to have a little run down the stretch and hopefully take it to the postseason. No one in Maryland history has more career wins or strikeouts than Schwarren, who also ranks third all-times in innings pitched and among the top six in earned run average. Yet we can actually confirm he is not truly a unicorn.